one, go. Here comes 386 out of Florida, driving straight ahead and delivering the gear in autonomous mode. 10 seconds remaining. Red Alliance also has a gear delivery in autonomous mode, courtesy of 6357, 6061, and 3303 Metallic Thunder. We're tied up at the end of Autonomous Road. Two minutes, 15 seconds now as we're rolling into the human players. Drivers behind the driver's station, pilots on the aircraft, humans at the load station ready to fill up that robot with gears. Here they come. Let's watch 6357, see if they can deliver it. Those are the rookies, 6357, out of Dripping Springs, Texas. They have a gear. They're making their way through the neutral zone and back across the center. They're going around the far outside in front of the boiler. Coming into the airship, trying to mount that gear. They've delivered the gear. The pilot brings it into the airship and places it on the drivetrain. Good job, rookie 6357 out the Spring Constant. They're paired up with the Carbon Crusaders, a second-year team out of Australia, and Metallic Thunder from Fresno, California. Currently, Red Alliance has a five-point lead. Five-point lead for the Red Alliance. All these robots are currently ranked in the 20s and 30s, seating-wise. Great head-to-head -head competition here on Galileo. With one minute remaining, it still stays, still looks very close here in qualifying match 71. I know we have some fans for the Red Alliance. If you think the Red Alliance is going to pull this out, let me hear from you. What if you think the Blue Alliance is going to finish on top? Blue Alliance team members, you hear? Let me hear from you. Just like the score, very close on the cheering. We're counting down to 30 seconds here on Galileo. 30 seconds, you'll hear the steam whistle. Pilots will drop their ropes, and the robots will have to decide, do we take flight or do we continue scoring? There's the steam whistle. Oh, we got shots courtesy of 386. 386 on the boiler now as time ticks down. 20 seconds remaining. 56-54, maybe immobile right there for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance has one robot, now two. Whoa, look at that Red Alliance jump up there. Five seconds remaining. Three, two, one. Whoa, big finish for the Blue Alliance. Let's see if it holds up. The Blue Alliance crowd might have predicted the finish as it looks like Blue Alliance took the victory, waiting for the all clear.